Hey everyone, and welcome back to the X-Ring. So, been missing from doing any videos here. You guys know we just got a camper, so we've been doing some little, little bit of traveling. So what we'll do is we'll take you along this weekend, show you the, the camper, the setup, some of the nuances of it, and then hopefully show you guys like Fontana Dam and maybe Joyce Kilmer Memorial Forest out in Tennessee and North Carolina. Beautiful country, great time of year. You okay? <laughs> So we're on top of the TVA dam and you can actually see the little camper all the way down there. So that is Fontana Lake. Used to be a huge valley. It's not like Hoover Dam or anything. But you can still drive across it. So these are the spillway gates. It explains when the reservoir is full, instead of an overflow spillway, Fontana has two concrete tunnels. And these carry the water from the reservoir to the Little Tennessee River below more water can be used to generate electricity. So these control the water. This was built in 1942 and it's 480 feet tall. Now we're at the overlook. guys can get your bearings. Got mini X here. There it is. So about 15 minutes away, now we're at the bottom and we just passed Fontana Village. Um, you guys can see out here the river and we're actually camping down that road there for a little ways. But we're gonna actually head up what they call 28. This is gonna end up in Deals Gap which is the Dragon Temple. If you're a motorcyclist, it's one of the premier destinations to stop at to ride the curves. It's like 312 curves in 11 miles or something like that, or 400 and something, it's insane. But it's a huge mecca. I used to come here way back in the day before anybody knew what the Dragon was. It was just called Deal's Gap. So let's go check it out and look at the Tree of Shame. Now it is just beautiful along the whole way, the Montana River. So I'm going to let you in on a little secret. Mini X's kryptonite <laughs> is curves in a car, even if you do like five. So she's got the window down and we're driving really slowly, but she's feeling a little yellow. <laughs> Get it, yellow? 26 and a 55, well, this is what I get. <laughs> so if you haven't heard of Deals Gap, all the car clubs and motorcycle guys will bring their cars up here and cut up a fool. We used to come down here and do tests and tunes on our motorcycles, our race bikes, way back in the day. Now this was going to be in the late 80s, early 90s, and uh, it didn't look anything like it looks now. It used to be like a little shanty. It was run by one guy, and he was bought out, and now it's turned into this premier destination spot for motorcycles and car enthusiasts alike. So when we get up here, I'll try to get you some footage of some of these cars rolling through here, and they do patrol it quite heavily. Alright guys, so here we go, coming up on Deals Gap Motor Motorcycle Resort. And you guys can see I'm going to have a hard time finding a place to park around here. But, yeah, it's just a premier destination for, for everything. Let's go check it out. Alright guys, the infamous Tree of Shame. Like I said, this has been cleared many, many times. Eastern, 
grill. Pretty cool. All kind of t-shirts, patches. Joyce Kill Memorial Forest is only about 16 miles away. It's one of the oldest stands of old growth forest left. So let's head over there. This is the Poco Lodge. It's been here for quite a while. So about once a year they actually flood this out and you'll have some of the best kayakers in the world come here and do this section. You can't even find a place to stop along the side of the road, but just some unbelievable drop-offs and it's pretty cool. So this is the Little Tennessee River. If I'm not mistaken, I think this right here is Chihuahua Dam. I believe this is where they filmed Harrison Ford. Kilmer was a poet and patriot, born in 1886, died in 1918. So we're gonna try to make our way, it's a two mile loop up to the old growth forest. So walking through here, the trees are starting to get massive. I know they don't block it on the video, but you're seeing remnants of some of these larger trees that are down. You know, trees do have a lifespan. They don't just live forever. And so whether it be disease or anything like that, we're starting to see some of those. Quite a few that are falling down in the woods here, but let's work our way up to the top. So this is about a mile into it or so. You have a Joyce Kilmer Memorial, dedicated in 1936. 165th Infantry, Rainbow Division. Killed in France in 1918. Now we're talking, that's a big old tree. Yeah, so this tree is about four, four and a half feet. So this time of year is actually pretty awesome. Check out all the green undergrowth. It's like carpet out here. It's beautiful. This is really cool. Check out this root system. It's like a carpet of roots. All right, guys, I know you're probably getting bored of these, but these trees are massive. Unbelievable. I know it's not like Sequoia or anything, but to see it on the East Coast. Hey, Ella, why don't you stand on that rock? Show them how small you are compared to the tree. Yeah. Fingertip to fingertip. So yeah, these are some monster trees. Pretty cool. What fun would it be without a suspension bridge?
like it. <laughs> so what would a camping trip be without a fire? All right, well, it's raining, so we decided to break camp. It's supposed to rain all day, but hope you guys enjoyed that. I know it wasn't shooting content, but uh, a little bit of back scenes to the X-Ring family. You guys, like, share, and subscribe. We'll talk to you soon. Have a good one. See you.